Beat the final boss. Oh. oh no. That wasn't the final boss, was it? Oh no, I think this might be the final. Previously. Previously. Come clean with us, O'Brien. Don't leave anything out. Yes, please explain yourself. So here's the problem with I couldn't risk it because there was a mole involved, right? Mm -hmm. What if Parker was the mole? Who? Parker. His reasoning for only sending two people to the boat was, what if there was a mole in the in the BSAA that was working for for Morgan? Which a, how did he know that? But b. What if Parker or Jill were the mole? What if Jessica or Chris were- OH SHIT! <laughs> Jessica was the mole! So the whole plan didn't work out anyway! Well, he didn't tell any of them what he was doing. That was why he didn't tell them. Yeah. He still sent them to do it, he just- But why didn't, didn't he why. send a hundred people to the boat and not tell them? Cause there would be a mole. Anyway, the queen is dead. He was explaining why they why he didn't tell them, not why he sent them. He sent them because they're in the BSAA. Okay, so then why he sent them still doesn't make any sense. Yes. Yeah. Queen Dido. Yes, the Queen Dildo. Resting on the ocean floor since that day. Which means we'll find her. At the ocean floor exactly. since that day. <laughs> we have a responsibility to see this mission through. Who's we? See this mission true. Yeah, you take a breather, John Goodman. I love the Sonic and Knuckles, or Sonic and Shadow photo. I know. Oh, is this where he injects himself and turns into a Birkin monster? Yeah. We saw you were using Pornhub. <laughs> we found you through your RedTube account. You're under arrest. Oh, no. This guy is a vampire. <laughs> he really is. A name that rolls right off the tongue. Clive R. O'Brien. I would have liked O'Brien better if he had like an aggressively heavy Irish accent. Yeah. If he was like, Chris, Jill, you're our only hope. Sweet Mother of Mary, they found the ship. The Queen Dino. Chris looks like... Oh my, did you that, see that water was a little rough. Chris looks like if he always wore, like, eyeliner, but just this one time he was. <laughs> yeah, he, this is makeup off Chris. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then, yeah, Jessica's like, I think you're prettier without makeup. And he's like, that's not the point. I don't do it for you. <laughs> it's really insulting to my craft that you say I'd look better without it. I put a lot of work in that shit, you know. It's expensive. What, what the fuck does that say? <laughs> it looks like Minecraft. This texture says Queen Dido. <laughs> <laughs> Time to go through the same ship again. You know what they say. The third strike is what counts. But this time it's all sunken. I can't wait to quick TE. Please let me quick TE. Yes. Quick TE. That's what I'm going with. QTE. Look at my boob clipping into the fucking thing on me. <laughs> Alright, here we go. You know what this reminds me of, actually? This is gonna sound really stupid. This reminds me of in Dead Space 3, the parts where you go into, like, the dead ships. Like, out there's, like, there's a bunch of SCAF, uh, that's, like, the military organization from the Dead Space universe. 
Um, but they were the, they were the colonists from like like hundreds of years ago, and um, it's all the scaf ships are floating in orbit around the the ice planet that you go to, and you're like drifting through the halls and shit and all these like like they're familiar areas, but they're like completely dead and spooky. Ooh, it's the slugs. Oh, I can't scan under here. Um, I like how it's just like it's flat to the ground, but it's not. I need to play Dead Space. Yeah, we need oh. to play Dead Space. I would love to do an LP of that. Series. You know what Doom 2016 would have benefited from? Uh, Zero G sections. Yeah. Ooh, that guy got it hard. Or like, I don't know, just more like... Because they focused a lot on vertical movement, but like... If the final level is like you got launched out into space with a bunch of shit and you had to like shoot them in space. Yeah. <laughs> if Sinistar was in the game. Yeah, the final boss is Sinistar. We can only hope who for the Doom 2. Who the fuck made Sinistar? I think Midway? Do some research on who okay. the fuck made Sinistar. Because he needs to come back. I'm surprised he hasn't. <laughs> That's the next reboot, calling it. Uh, Sinistar is fucking scary. Yeah. Welcome to your doom. I am Sinistar. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Williams Electronics. Who the actual fuck? They're still going, apparently. What did they? What else did they make? Uh, initially, manufacturer of pinball machines. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, golden age of arcade games. Uh, uh oh, there's a big old sluggo in here. Paddle ball. <laughs> Paddle ball. Which is a pong clone. Mm. Defender, Stargate, Joust. Ooh. Is there nothing back here? No. I mean, it's a pretty strong lineup so far. Oh. That's a one-hit kill. That's good to know. I guess they make gambling machines now. <laughs> nice. How do you get out of video games after making Joust and Sinistar? I don't know. I think that, um... Midway... Well, Midway's dead. Yeah. They're, they're Nether Realm now. Yeah. But... I think they own Sinistar, because I was on, like, I don't know. So you're saying that Sinistar is in the next Mortal Kombat game? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Let's look up who owns Sinistar. I got eight again. I have no idea who owns Sinistar. It's really hard to find out who owns rights to things. Yeah. Because I've, I've been wondering forever who owns the rights to Rengoku. Sunsoft. Did you know Sunsoft just made a fucking game? But Sunsoft is dead. No, they're not. It turns out they're not. They made a VR MOBA. Oh. On PlayStation VR. Oh yeah, I remember this part. It fucking sucks. I don't know where to go. I got... Oh, I see. I see on the map now. You're gonna get eight. I know. This is where I had to go. But I wasn't to know there was something down there. Oh, there's a depth charge in this fucking... Why is this boat so rusted and shitty? It's only been sitting here for a year. A lot can happen in a year. Boats don't decompose like this in a year. Boats full of viruses might. The virus wouldn't affect metal. Those blobs ate all the paint chips. What are those blobs? <laughs> yeah, the blobs ate all the paint chips. They're the slugs from the beach. No, that's not what I'm asking. <laughs> You're asking what are those slugs from the beach? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Are they like sea cucumbers? This is dire music. It is really dire. It's like Disney It's not, fucking... a, not as dire as Open Your Heart, but I mean... Yeah. I hope that fucking joke was worth it. I hope it was too. <laughs> Look at this evil I'm sure people here. wouldn't be watching past that point anyway, because they would assume that's the last boss. Yeah. 
Which is what I assume too. I wish it was the last boss. That's why you can't say like... You can't do outros because when, when people hear an outro... Like, that's time to shut the video off because nothing else is coming. Like, when I'm watching one of Mr. Shady Penguin's videos. And he's like, have yourself a nice day, above all else! And then it's cut to nothing because I don't, I don't watch the rest of it. <laughs> this video is sponsored by, uh... Loot Break. Get, get your box of loot. Th this yeah. month's, uh, thing... Is Justice League. <laughs> This month's theme is Justice. And the League. That is based on Justice. Loot box is so fucking stupid. Though. Like, they Your don't- box will come with a bunch of ice. Yeah. And nothing else. Just, just ice. Just ice. <laughs> uh, but no, like, I, that's when I started to get really pissed off about Loot Crate. Like, it was just stupid before. But you can't say that in case they, they sponsor fuck, us one day. Fuck Loot Crate. No, Loot Crate's I want to be sponsored by, like, Sargento and shit. <laughs> I want to be sponsored by Pure Leaf fucking tea. Who does that? Uh, Pure Leaf. Isn't that Lipton or something? I don't know. I don't know. But, um, I want to be sponsored by Ghirardelli and shit. But anyway, like, when they started just going, like, Batman vs. Superman came out, and they're like, this month's theme is Versus. And it's like, yeah. You can just say, here's your Batman vs. Superman box, you guys. Like, you don't have to be, like, a condescending, like... You don't have to fucking insult my intelligence by acting like you're tricking me with that shit. Well, no, they make it vague enough that they can put, like... Wait. What were you saying? What? What What word did you say for Loot Crate? For, for Batman? Versus. Versus. They make it vague enough that they can put, like, Injustice stuff in there. And, like, Street Fighter... That, but just say it's Batman vs. Superman themed, <laughs> you know? Time to listen to this. This is Agent Dario Barioni of the FBC Armed Forces. This is Agent Spaghetti Meatball. <laughs> I request that this recorder be handed over to General Lansdale. If found by the next team, everyone on my team is dead. Killed by the devil himself. We were unable to retrieve the video log. Our mission has failed. Well, Tro, they weren't sitting around waiting for death to come to them. When the FBC arrived, they were waiting for us. Even though Terra Grigio was a year ago. Thoughts of revenge kept them alive. Yeah. So, Morgan sent the FBC guys to come find the video evidence of him, like, pissing on Russian beds or whatever. And then the, the, the Veltro guys were waiting for them because they knew they'd come for the evidence. How come yeah. this boat looks completely different than the other two? Hey, this boat is a cool setting. Yeah. I wish more of the game took place here. <laughs> You know it's bullshit. Uh, I know for a fact that, that she has a flashlight on her fucking thing. Yeah, because she used it earlier. Because I can't also, fucking see shit. But also, I only have two guns. It's fine. Because my uh, the rocket launchers replaced one of my guns, and then. Do you think you're actually gonna fucking fight anything in here? I don't know, man. Oh god, this is a really cool area. Oh my god. And these are people. Oh, these must be Veltro soldiers. Yeah. Spooky Halloween door. Turn on your flashlight. The fucking candle. Somebody turned down the candles. Oh my god. What the fuck was that? Why did those candles dim? This isn't a. This is a note. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dante da Vinci offering to the dead. A pass has been underlined. How the rain maketh them like unto dogs. One side they make a shelter for the other. Oft turn themselves the wretched reprobates. Dante's Alighieri the, the, the comedy. The divine comedy. Those who offer their lives to the doctrine forever walk the path with the great Jack Norman. Wow, what a divine, That's... what a divine name, Jack yeah. Norman.
I'm gonna Google like what Veltro is a reference to. It's Velcro. Oh, that's someone. right. I'm sorry. Oh wait. It's Jack Norman. The Queen Dido is already deep below the sea. There's no escape, no chance of survival. Unless. Unless what? <gasps> It's a greyhound that was in the Divine Comedy. Okay. Named Veltro. That's why he's there. Yeah. Jack Norman was the head of Veltro. He has a video we can use to nail Lansdale. <laughs> that is who that was. It's weird that he had a video screen up here to play that just for us. Yeah, that is weird that that video triggered as soon as we walked in the room. Yeah, it was here just so we could see it. Okay. Better, better stock up. Yep. Why is that, Nick? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. No reason. So let me give you some advice. No. None of these weapons that you have mm -hmm. are going to do you any good. Yeah. I remember the sniper doing me good. I remember this fight being fucking terrible. That shotgun ammo. And I know I say that a lot. It's because it happens a lot. But when we have to retry this like six times, <laughs> don't blame us. All right. That loaded fast. Yeah, it did. It's it this wasn't... area is cool. This is fucking awesome. Why didn't they make the rest? Oh, of I thought the this. Boats I like thought this, this dude's head was gone. How come two of the boats were exactly the same to the point that they were broken in the same way, but this one's completely different? He he's speaking shit. But also. He's quoting Dante. This is a That's fucking. Weird that there's no s fucking subtitles for that. This is a fucking Castlevania staircase. Yeah, it is. Each one shall find again his dismal tomb. Shall reassume his flesh and his own figure. Shall hear what through eternity re echoes. His voice sounds different when he's quoting Dante. Mm hmm. There he is. He's quoting it. Oh. You alright, Jack? Morgan! Morgan Lansdale! How dare you cross Veltro! Belmont. Son of <laughs> Belmont. <laughs> Dracula, die here, die now and leave this world. You'll never belong here. Ah, but this world invited me. I'm, Your UI sir, is still here. Sir, I don't think... I think you have the wrong number, sir. That's not me. This little machine cost me $999. Well, why didn't... Why don't you want... Let's just grab the phone and then leave. I got it. Now let's get out of here. PVA. Now, now, now let's just leave. Yeah, it's fine. I would leave if I thought I could leave. <laughs> I think you have to try oh, to leave. Oh, do I have to actually try? <laughs> Why are you listening to him? He's crazy! <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, I thought he was gonna drink it. He might. Oh, he did just drink it. Oh no, wait. Oh, he didn't do anything. Yeah, he just opened it and then didn't do anything. Now this boss... Now, we've said a lot of stuff and this is fucking stupid. This boss is fucking stupid, but I really like it's it. It's stupid in the best way It's possible. stupid in a cool way, in, the, in a way that the rest of the game should have been stupid. When we said this was Castlevania, we weren't lying. <laughs> well, I don't even know if I would say that, but as soon as we see it, I will... I will. You remember Cookie Monster from Castlevania <laughs> yeah, 1? Yeah, oh man, Cookie Monster. It's my favorite. That's what this is. My favorite Castlevania boss. You walk down... He's like, Belmont, son of Belmont, throws wine glass, fuck you. <laughs> throws wine glass, eat shit, Belmont. <laughs> Turns into Cookie Monster. Yeah. I love the flapping his arms animation. So, there he is. So this is a fucking tyrant and a half. That's... Stop. Morgan isn't here. It's no use. He's gone over the edge. Yeah, so this... Yeah, you can teleport now. This is a Final Fantasy boss. Yes, it is. And literally 0% of this boss makes any sense at all. It's he a, should have been in Marvel Infinite. He should have been. His ability to <laughs> teleport is fucking bullshit. It doesn't make any sense, but he's so cool looking. Okay, the thing is on his back that you have to shoot. Oh, that's right. He should be in fucking Soul Calibur 6. He's yeah. so fucking cool looking. So I don't remember the best way to go about this. I you think know what the best way to is? Is the dodge. Yeah. The best way to do it is to dodge. But I think you have to run past him in quick turn and then shoot. I don't know if that works. I mean when he it's, shows up like Especially that. since he's yeah. a world going. But no, his turn radius is too too crazy. I don't know Get if up. I can like... I'm trying. I don't know if I can like bust his leg or... I, cause I can't... Oh, you know what you have to do? What? You have to shoot his heart when he's about to hit you. Oh. I forgot. That's how you do it. Oh, does his heart pop out? Yeah, when he's about to slash. See? Oh, there we go. And then you run behind him and start shooting that. Or, or no. not. He must, or just he keep must, shooting his heart. He must stagger longer. Oh, am I dead? I bet I die really cool if I let him go. Oh, I probably don't, actually. Because in RE4, RE, uh, he would have crushed my fucking brains out. Oh, no. Should yeah, probably... I think you have to hit him in the heart a couple more times. Then he'll go down. Then yeah. you start hitting him with that. Ah. Oh, that's a big ground pound. Yeah. So this is the boss that spoiled in the um, in the uh, the like the the shop screen for this game. I was trying to charge. <laughs> Come on, Norman. Norman Jaden is the final boss. He keeps like moving slightly and I can't hit him. Yeah, I remember using the machine gun a lot. Cause like you can just pop a bunch. Yeah. Hey, we're out of healing items. So. I remember this not being great, but I remember this being real not great because I just did like earlier this year. And like he doesn't get hurt unless you hit that. Yeah. Oh, I wonder if I can. That didn't no. bother him. Okay. No, no. Ah. Wow. Okay. Well, good luck. Yeah. You should let him grab you to see what happens. Yeah. Grab me, bro. Yeah. This is like the King Alant throw. I want him to fucking. Oh, that's it. Oh, come on. I want him to just squeeze. Just show us! Look at his stupid face. You know what my problem is with this? Uh, this is too perfect. What do you mean? Because the tyrant had to be grown in a fucking test tube. Oh, you mean this? And this everyone is... since has just been able to be tyrant by injecting themselves with the fucking thing. Yeah, that's a good point. That, that tyrant took work to make... And, and like even Birkin, he was he was a tyrant type thing, but like he was busted. And yeah, not. he was busted all over. And then his arm that he injected it in was way bigger than the rest of them. Yeah, because it got all the juice to the point where that became his head. Yeah. 
Yeah, and it was like the whole monster was, he was just kind of attached to it. Like his little tiny torso was in the side, and he's like, no. Like he looks sad. Yeah, know? eventually turned into that weird fucking dog. Yeah. But, and, and Nemesis was tyrant like because he was also made like tyrant. Yeah, he was made at Umbrella Incorporated. Yeah, and they, 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 they dropped him in a fucking box. That's <laughs> one of the coolest things about Umbrella Chronicles is them showing him falling into the fucking, mm -hmm. like, stage. They do that with Mr. X and too. Yeah, where the, you see the box fall. Yeah. And just pop out. And that's, like, the coolest. Like, like that's the cool thing about BOWs, like, them dropping hunters out of helicopters. Like that shit's actually kind of cool because it's like the it's the normalization of of the horror shit, and that's where it's okay to become actiony, is where when you do it like that. Yeah. Isn't there a box in here? Yeah, there is. Oh, I remember that shit. Cause I, I, I didn't know that. Cause I thought that was weird. I can see it. Oh god. So I remember one part of this boss fight that I, if I you actually... don't mind if I spoil something since we're gonna see it soon anyway. Go for it while I'm while I'm doing this. Does he still go while you're in here? No, he's frozen, but he's next to me. You can see the purple smoke coming out from his face. So I don't know if you remember that he makes clones of himself. I vaguely remember. Illusion style clones. Like Genjutsu. Fuck. I wish he just auto scoots backwards. But yeah, I'm trying to think because there have been other just. This is just Tyrant. Like, this yeah. is straight up just Tyrant. It is. Both as a fish. And well, also it's with Bison Teleport. It's Tyrant with bat wings and. Those are fish fins. They're fucking bat wings, dude. Look at them. <laughs> I don't know why he's so fishy. I couldn't turn fast enough. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't turn fast enough. But you know, that's the solution is. The Very solution, good. the solution is legit dodge and then shoot, like quick turn shoot in the back, but. But you can't dodge, so. But yeah. no, you actually have to shoot him in the chest, cause. Do it. I'm. I'm trying. No, to, no. it's not gonna work. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's not. Gonna I don't work. care what you're telling me. You could have shot him like four times there. Oh, he'll do it again. It'll be fine. He's behind you. Whenever he teleports away and back like that, he's gonna be behind you. I tried to quick turn dodge that. <laughs> this is great. I would turn off the audio and put like, um... What's it called? The Sonic Adventure 2. Oh, live and learn. Yeah, I put live and learn over this. But then we missed the cutscene. Yeah, then it would fuck up the cutscene is why I'm not gonna. That's cut it. the the weirdest fucking. That it choice. really is. It it's like the birds and and bugs sound effects from um. Oh yeah, there we are. It it's like the the nature sound effects being part of Skyrim's BGM. Yeah. Well, like that's fine. Yeah, that's that's like ambience, but. So, so the purple the purple smoke is how you yeah. can tell them apart. He starts making shadow clones. He attacks really fast out of that. Chris is just standing in the corner and giving you more Yeah, support. he's kind of vaguely... Oh, 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 oh. That was bullshit. That was bullshit, but I dodged somehow, so it's fine. But yeah, I, I would really love the explanation of how this thing fucking works. I like the explosion. Why is he, he starts turned away from me? <laughs> yeah. I gotta stop He's aiming. Gotta, yeah, stop aiming and just... What? Oh, Christ. That... I, how am I... I couldn't pull my gun up fast enough to hit him. That's how he do. He's gonna grab you. I'd like to see him fucking try. Oh fuck. Uh, need some help here, Chris. Behind. Oh no. It wasn't behind. I can't I, I can't deal with this. Let's see if the BOW decoy gets him. It actually fucked me up and got my ass kicked. Isn't there? Yeah, there's green rooms here. 
over by Chris. He's safeguarding the green herbs for me. Maybe if I pull him over by Chris, Chris will be forced to help. Yeah. It's really obnoxious that the attack is like full full screen. Wow, I hit him and it didn't, it didn't stagger him. <laughs> but yeah, having a full screen unblockable as your main melee attack is kind of annoying. But it's alright, I guess. Turning away from me so I can't hit your fucking weak point isn't nice, though. Apparently, headshots do damage, just not a whole lot. Okay. No, not if he teleports, they don't. Nice. <laughs> Are there no killer herbs around? I, got, I grabbed one, but I don't think there's any more. There's ammo. Oh, there's one. Which I will now use now. They said to use a, a high-powered weapon like a magnum for the head shots. Oh yeah, didn't we get one? I think so. See, now he's he, now he's pissed. Now he's very upset. He's making necroid necro necroid noises. How the hell did he do, that? do what? He ran up and punched you. That's how he did it. You, you're gonna ask uh, about the running up and punching and not the, the teleporting? What the fuck? What? He just like shoryuken me. The problem is I can't... Like I can't get the um... Oh god. Oh Christ. Fuck, I couldn't... Now you can't see colors, so I it's know. like bullshit. I think there's one over by Chris. Uh, it's, no, I, I already got that one. <laughs> I need um... It's just, you don't have any ammo. Oh, that's right. That's why I'm not using Good. it. Wait, no. Capacity 8. Oh, yeah, but I don't have any. Got one of those. Do it. Fuck it. I mean, the rifle isn't helping me, so... That's a phantom. A phantom. How am I supposed to stop him from doing that? Take out your rifle launcher. You? You're gonna die anyway. You might as well try it. Yeah. No, not yet. Yeah, make sure. <laughs> Ooh. I got him. Oh, oh. I... oh my god. I actually got him. No, hit him in the back. Oh, 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 oh. Hit him in the back. Or no, he... he's dead. Oh my god. That was amazing. Holy shit. Look at his big creepy vagina mouth. I can't believe that worked. I, I also can't believe that worked. <laughs> Chris, what's wrong with your face? No, oh, my PDA. He's still got the weird split mouth that the that the things have. Oh, oh no, and now the no. boat underwater is on fire. His oil-soaked flag that he put the candles next to. <laughs> <laughs> what a big stupid idiot. This is how Morgan treats his friends. Who are you who are you cool guying to, Chris? <laughs> He killed fucking- <laughs> He murdered everyone! <laughs> <laughs> uh. The means of dispersion? The cruise ship is equipped with a UAV. That is your delivery system. It's like a paper airplane, but bigger. Very well. Now show me the goods. Why did they spend, like, zero time fixing this guy's face for the HD remake? At least we know he was so blatant in that statement because that was to let everyone know. He was saying that for the video. Mm -hmm. As you can see, it's not likely you'll be wriggling out of this one. 
I seem to have underestimated the BSA. Is that the book that O'Brien wrote? No, that's that's the Divine Comedy oh. that he's been quoting. How did you... We're done analyzing it, so you can have it back. Director O'Brien, surely you understand our dilemma. Without the Terra Grigia panic, the ignorant masses would be unaware of the threat that lies before them. What if you just told yes. them... What if you just showed them a hunter on TV and were like, Yeah, these things are made of alligators, <laughs> but they can run better and, sl and like cut you and shit. You couldn't have blown up like a regular city? Do you have the authority to do that? Suspicion? <laughs> Due respect, Director O'Brien. The BSAA is making a huge mistake. How? I he should be like I already won, <laughs> you know? Yeah. Never heard that before. Nowhere, because this is like the first time we've talked to you guys. Yeah, I don't know. Congratulations, everyone. We did it. We Look, it's that it's that Smith's album. We beat the video game. The storm is gone. Oh, thanks, Director O'Brien, for my life. Yep. I'm surprised we only died once on that boss. Did we die once? Yeah. Oh yeah. That's right. I can't believe you survived long enough to shoot a rocket launcher at him. <laughs> I can't believe the rocket launcher didn't kill me. We should have just started with that. We can finally reveal what happened in Terra Grigia. Yeah, but the cost was high. The BSAA will have to be overhauled. The storm is gone now. <laughs> but how long will it last? <laughs> the storm is gone now. It'll last up until you're blonde. And Chris is swole. After Morgan Landale's less, the SBC was dissolved. The majority of its agents and resources transferred to the Bassa. Bassa! The Bassa would then be reformed into an anti bear bioterrorism organization under the auspice Aus of the United States. Wait, what was Ref it before? Yeah, exactly. Weren't, that was their job. That's what the B stands for, isn't is, it? I think oh so. Oh my god. Oh my god, Quint and Keith just, they survived. Ain't I a stinker? They did it. Keith Lumley is now a leading figure at the BSA's at East African branch due to his accomplishments in the Kukimoki. Quint Ketchum, on the other hand, continues to refuse promotion to any leadership position, but he still works at the BSA's main headquarters in the R&D department. Parker survived death six times in a row. And he still can't figure out the Genesis Manual. He's found a drift offshore of the Republic, Republic of Malta in the Mediterranean Sea and was rescued. This motherfucker should be dead. After a month of medical treatment, Parker returned to his position as a special operations agent for the BSAA's main headquarters. What if he shows up in like eight? I hope so. Oh no. Clive R. O'Brien decided to take responsibility for his actions and stepped down from his position as head of the BSAA. And this scene drives me fucking crazy. That everyone treats him like a hero because he refused to just, like, do things like a normal human being. <laughs> He's currently an advisor of the BSAA, is also writing a, direct, a detective novel. From the comfort of his own home. That's the novel that's in Resident Evil 7. There's the book in RE7. Oh my god, what is this? This is Resident Evil 5. What? They have no idea what horrific fate awaits them. Both of them survive. Both of them. Only them and no one else. Sent to deal with the superhuman. 
That's cool that they, they nod to Resident Evil 5's DLC. So there you go, guys. There's Resident Evil Revelations. So... Uh, so, yeah, like, our thoughts are pretty summed up, I guess. Yeah, that, I'm not like, saying fucking anything else. I mean... Like, yeah, I mean, the, the solution to everything is just, like... Like, okay... The, her, I saw Harada and I was like, what? Okay, so <laughs> the thing with Lansdale is the reason, like, all of this was to get video evidence that O'Brien assumed existed. Like, it was discovered during the course of the mission that Norman, that Jack Norman had video evidence of all that shit, but Brian O'Brien was just looking for anything, right? Yeah. He was looking for any information at all. Now, would that information not have been in some kind of monetary transaction? Because Norm, uh, Morgan, the names Morgan and Norman are too close. <laughs> but Morgan, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, which one's Morgan? Morgan is the bad guy, not which the final one? boss. He's he, that's Satan. Norman, Jack Norman is the Final Fantasy boss. But 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 Morgan is Satan. Morgan is Satan. Okay, okay, okay. Now I'm all. Now I'm all. Now we're all caught up. On who the characters in this game are. So, <laughs> Morgan had to have developed or purchased the T-Abyss virus. So, somewhere there is a facility or a, a manufacturer or somebody who sold him or developed the T-Abyss virus for him. Would that not be easier to have, like, searched for a paper trail or sent anybody? Like, I don't know. There has to be an easier way for him to have figured out. Other than sending two random people to a random boat that appeared randomly in the Mediterranean that may or may not be filled with fucking, like, monsters. I'm gonna be honest with you here. Um, seeing Ri Rise, or what was that, Lost in Nightmares? Yeah. From Resident Evil 5. All that's making me want to do it's is just play, play, just yeah. play Resident Evil 5 it's, right now. Just play a game with Wesker in it. Yeah. Like, Cause, oh, wait. Because Wesker's so fucking cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But, I mean, that's not even the point. I mean, like, like... I don't fucking care about any of this. Yeah, I still because, don't. because none of this matters. Because <laughs> this is a prequel, but it doesn't ever have any fucking impact on anything that happens later. And as a spinoff story, it would have been cool, except for it doesn't make any sense. And it's too big scale. And maybe I'm just... Maybe it's just my frustration with it that I'm making it sound worse than it is. But, like... Do you guys like Parker and Jessica and... But yeah, that's the thing. Is Again, this whole story revolves around a group of characters that don't matter and don't really, like... They don't do nothing. Like... Why... They, like, they may still exist somewhere. Like, okay, the reason... I guess this is part of it. The reason that, that Jill and Barry and Chris and all those characters are, like, important... And the reason they were on their own in the mansion is because they got separated in the mansion, right? And they were all separated for that shit. And Jill was alone in Raccoon City, but she ran into other people, but she was alone because she was a specialist or whatever. Chris and- or Leon and, and Claire got separated in Raccoon City, that's why they were alone. But if you're working in a fucking force like this... RE4, Leon was alone because he was the president's, like, special bodyguard or whatever, because he was an expert on the Raccoon City shit. Why would they send people alone ever in the BSAA? Like, it doesn't make any sense. Hold on, though. Even in RE5, they send Chris with people, Hold but on, he gets though. separated from them. It then meets up again and then separates again. Where are we? In a coffee shop. Is that Bayonetta? Yeah. Hey, Bayonetta. She's reading Dante. She's reading Dante. She's reading Loveless from Final Fantasy VII. Wow, yeah, just flash that around in public. Oh! <gasps> It's Pauline. <gasps> it's Wesker. <laughs> By the way, why save Parker? I have my reasons. Fucking the SAA isn't as useless as I thought. Things could really heat up. Indeed. Fun's just getting started. Dude, just let this sit there, next to the fucking olive oil. <laughs> so, 
So, yeah, he just, just set that out in the open and just leave it there on the table. That's fine. But, so that's kind of a huge cliffhanger. That, yeah, that's that, never expanded upon in the sequel yeah. to this game or any of this, the games that came after this in the timeline. So, I had to remember his name. There we go. Oh, um, cool. So, Raymond was a double-double agent, <laughs> and he was and he was working with Jessica, which makes it extra fucked up that Jessica shot him. Um... And Jessica was working on, like, she's her own devices. She's Ada Wonging that shit. And she wanted the virus for herself for something. And so, and after just displaying it in public like that, and saying, fun's just getting started, they, Rev 2 doesn't talk about that at all. And I watched all that game's cutscenes. They literally never, ever, ever talk about the T-Abyss virus ever again. And if they do, I will cut back to this, because I'll sound like a fucking idiot. But that game's about, like, a character, a previously mentioned character... Like offhand mentioning characters. Yes, yeah. it's it's several previously mentioned characters that have nothing to do with this game. They're from the main thing. But congratulations, you are your winner. Now you can use the save data to start a new game with all your equipment intact. Would you like to clear save a clear data? Okay, save. Um, but yeah. So first half of this game, pretty okay, except for when you're playing as Chris or Queef. Chris is better than the other one. Second half of the... Well, the problem with Chris is his environment. Yeah. That stupid snowy mount, mountain and shit. And the second half of this game, kind of a fucking mess. But it's fun to play. And I don't remember if there's anything else. Nope. There's nothing. Select outfit has been added to campaign menu. Cool. But now... Now. 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 